The Aesthetics of Chaosmos, The Middle Ages of James Joyce by Umberto Eco, one, the early Joyce. Quote, steeled in the school of the old Aquinas, end of quote, James Joyce, the Holy Office. The term poetics has acquired many meanings during the centuries. Aristotle's poetics is an answer to both the questions, quote, what is art, end of quote, and, quote, how does one make a work of art, end of quote. The modern philosophical tradition has preferred to define the theoretical answer to the first question as, quote, aesthetics, end of quote, and to utilize, quote, poetics, end of quote, in order to describe the program of a single artist or a particular artistic school. In this context, poetics addresses the question, how does one make a work of art according to a personal program and an idiosyncratic worldview? The more recent definition by the Prague Linguistic School considers poetics as the study of, quote, the differentia specifica of verbal behavior, end of quote. In other words, poetics is the study of the structural mechanism of a given text which possesses a self-focusing quality and a capacity for releasing effects of ambiguity and polysemy. Joyce plays with all these notions of poetics throughout his works. He interweaves questions as to the concept of art, the nature of his personal artistic program, and the structural mechanisms of the texts themselves. In this respect, all of Joyce's works might be understood as a continuous discussion of their own artistic procedures. A portrait is the story of a young artist who wants to write a portrait. Ulysses, a little less explicit, is a book which is a model of itself. Finnegan's Wake is, above all, a complete treatise on its own nature, a continuous definition of, quote, the book, end of quote, as the ersatz of the universe. The reader, therefore, is continually tempted to isolate the poetics proposed by Joyce in order to define, in Joycean terms, the solutions that Joyce has adopted. Although one can discuss the poetics of Horace, Boileau, or Valeri without referring to their creative works, Joyce's poetics cannot be separated from Joyce's texts. The poetics themselves form an intimate part of the artistic creation and are clarified in the various phases of the development of his opus. The entire Joycean project might thus be seen as the development of a poetics, or rather, as the dialectical movement of various opposite and complementary poetics the history of contemporary poetics in a game of oppositions and continuous implications.